as the conclusion of 2020 is upon us, let's be intentional about setting ourselves up for success in 2021. Now, we will be doing an entire series on SMART goals and intentions starting in January. And I'd like to end December with a focus on gratitude, especially as we're looking at moving into the holiday season. Hanukkah's already upon us. Christmas right around the corner, New Year shortly thereafter. Greeting these holidays in a very different way can bring up difficult feelings and emotions. Let's be really mindful to welcome in gratitude. Gratitude is one of those unique emotions that calms our amygdala down immediately. It soothes her. Why? Because it lets her know that there's something positive in this moment no matter what. I'd like to invite you to take a moment and reflect on something today for which you are grateful. This can be as small as the sun shining outside, perhaps a scarf around your neck, keeping it warm, even a piping hot cup of coffee this morning or a delightful cup of tea. It's really easy for us to miss the small pleasantries of day-to-day -day life when we're faced with the mire of difficulty. And taking a moment to be intentional about saturating our system in the small positive moments ultimately is teaching our brain to prioritize those experiences. I'd love to encourage you, even if it's just for the next several weeks as we move towards the new year, to find three moments of gratitude every single day and don't just find them, write them down. And if you'd like to go a little bit deeper, once you've written them down, use the format I am grateful for and then read through them and move into that self-havening touch. I am grateful for, I am grateful for, listing each item out loud and as your gratitude notebook expands, review more and more items and remind yourself, especially in those difficult or more painful moments, that there are small moments of gratitude around. Even if it's just the smile of somebody who greets you warmly on a walk. Tiny little micro doses of gratitude calm our fear brain. They soothe her and they build our brain with intention to focus on those little positive moments, the power of neuroplasticity. So let's use gratitude, especially in the coming weeks, to set ourselves up for success in 2021.